Not too bad. Now you've talked about this. I heard uh, Derek Shelton say this earlier today. When he gets ahead, you know, one and two, kind of put him away, not get it to two and two and three and two. Yeah, it, that's it, exactly. Um, you know, he's come out of some games uh, a little early because he's been hit around a little. Yeah. 98 at the knee. Phil Cuzzy calls the balls and strikes. Hit hard but foul. Three on Friday. And Contreras gets this pop up at that. Also out of play. Game for him. It's foul. Maybe, you know, maybe that's what he needed. A, a yeah. game to be a little different than his game. He was. Uh, Battle a little wildness, had to throw a ton of pitches early in that ball game. And the defense was broke. Struck him out, got a call. Yep. Very good at framing that one. And here we go. Zip. In the dirt, nice pick, Chavis. A lot of shortstop, third base. He's used to fielding balls like that off the bat. You know, it, that's just like picking a ball that was hit hard at you. Sometimes, you know, he's not a pro typical first baseman, but you got to play where you need it. Even though he has been in the league longer. Two and two. Another foul out of play. That is hit hard. Well, he loves hitting here. Oh. Madris makes it close. Well, nice play. Well, that was a nice, accurate throw. Cruz didn't have to do anything, but Patrick Wisdom. Too far away. Well, still three and two. Ninety-seven. Dominated coming through the minor lakes, obviously. Can't go out there hmm. again. Dinning. And another foul. Yes. They okay. can't put him in play because you know, he throws hard. Get mm. Great stuff. So they're, they're, they're fouling a lot of pitches off. Want to do it as early in the count as you can to, to get to get the dividends of that. Uh -huh. and going back to that start against the Cubs last year here. So no earned runs yet. Though the Cubs threaten. One and two. To center field, Reynolds trying to shade his eyes and makes the catch. Just enough room. Showing that, and he's running at Full speed. Great, great moment. You know, two things yesterday that I, the slide. He was just like smiling and laughing. It was great. Oh, here we go. A little bobble. 
gets him. Um, yeah, he's a guy that, you know, not really noticed right away, always, you know, under the radar. But it just is like, that's what stands out about him, and that's why he's always eventually notices, hey, when he goes somewhere new, he eventually is noticed because of how hard he works. Start hot out of the gate. Yeah. In the big leagues, three and one on Cruz. The look of joy on his face is playing the game of baseball. It goes back to, well, it's really much of the season. What we've seen, we've talked about with some of these younger players. Yeah. Uh, well, by a guy that's been in the big leagues a month. Hayward gets under that, pops it up, Hoy Park. I mean, you know, Mitchell doing that. That's a little bit of an eye opener for everybody today. Hey, these guys can do something. When I got the word that, that these two guys were coming up, I mean, I know everything that there's no, and then you notice, oh wow, this guy's really been mashing the baseball. That's hit hard. Sawinski back. Room. A couple of long fly ball outs here in the first two innings, but that was a little bit better for Contreras. A very entertaining game, but that was. Kind of a sideshow that added to the entertainment. I think it was Jake, if I'm not mistaken, talking to Matt Brown, who gets uh, to capture the squirrel. But Trying to know, lure the squirrel we back. We had a little bit of a circus act going on behind me, and I wore about a bag of seeds, and I got to check the back. A couple of the guys that were going for the squirrel, they were eating when they saw the squirrel first make its way on the TV. They hurried up, and one of the one of the uh, grounds crew guys had a bag of chips sitting about why exactly we were chasing down a squirrel last night. It's pretty interesting. You know, I had totally forgot that the squirrels can yep. uh, by chase to yep. keep that at all costs. You can't let that squirrel in your boat. Quick thinking there from Willie Harris skipping out of the way. Classic. And a strikeout. I think uh, Shelton had one of the best lines, maybe the best in terms of uh, baseball field conditions in the majors. Head groundskeeper Matt Brown, which <laughs> Shelton said. <laughs> oh, yeah, that wasn't a very good run. You know what? I was at the net, the size of the chain link. How was that going to stop the squirrel? Line to left. Off the padded wall. Throw so him he out. plays it perfectly. Throw to second base. Oh, close. Oh, oh. Another strike, by the way, to second base on the mark. You're getting the rebound and, and making the double. If they want to double, it's going to be competitive. They're really going to have to run for it. Now, if he goes back and tries to make that, he's been working with them all the time. Even in uh, these days where it's not a lot of fun to be out there early in the sun. But you got to do this. And. Sliding stop made. Park throws to first. Got him. Nicely done, Hoy Park. Two other that cares. So does he. Ball one on Hap. Most against the Bucks. To right, Madris is there. Nicely done. And Contreras loves it. Got 60 pitches. Cut down on that a little bit. And get through six innings. There. Six innings. Walked him in the first. We got a lot of folks on hand enjoying this one, of course. One and two. Like. Just missed a little too high. Hmm. But now it's like, okay. Like enough. It's a, a fly ball to the fence. He's had a couple of those. They're just outs, right? Doesn't matter. And drive deep hey. to center. That one might this not one be over the, the fence. fence. Yeah, that was a long, long way. Whoa. For the Pirates' bullpen. 13th for Wisdom. But that's why you can do that with a five run lead. Because, okay. They gave up. The run. Whoa. 461 feet. Ooh. 
back of the hit almost the back, hit the back yeah. wall. Last year for the Cubs. And Ortega. So yeah, there's the same thing. He went right at him. And he got a fly out. I mean five nothing five. Stay out of those deep counts. This season. Two and oh. Greg is it's a there's two oh fastball almost right down the middle and all I could do with it was foul yeah. it off. Sometimes works against the guys with the great stuff where they're getting foul ball after foul ball after foul ball. Cruz slings it over there. It's his third assist here. Two more with these Cubs tomorrow night and then the matinee game. Thursday at 1235 so get your ticket. Fourth of July weekend. It's this one hard to write. And he's going for two. No. <laughs> Great job by Madris. Holding him to a single off the wall. You're going to stop the runner. And I say that because I don't think that throw was really online. That'll be out of play. And he gets the veteran with the breaking ball. Gives up a home run to Wisdom. While enduring this treatment was his inability to do his favorite thing, and that is play the game of baseball. As Ronzi Contreras covers first for the first out of the fifth inning for the Bucko. Now. Ball one on Christopher Morrell. Is mine just waving to us? <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> 2 0 -ok count. I have no control over that. I understand. Talking to our director. Line drive picked by Hayes. Hit hard. But Hayes is right there. Unless it's over the fence. And then the bullpen has to try and catch it. And they didn't move. From Contreras coming up. Well, if he could get a quick out here. Yep, be nice. Chance to get six out of him. It's been a struggle for the Cubs this year, but Contreras is having. Three and one. Now. Ah. That wasn't very good. An unusual pierogi race. Oh, and two. Two, the first two pitches to Hap. One and two. Under the glove of Chavis, but there's a man out there in shallow right. That's Hoy Park. Nice job. 